Hey everyone, I'm Almar of AlmarsGuides.com and in this video here, I'm going to show you where to get three pieces of glass gear in Kogarun of Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind. So we're starting out in the town of Balmora right now because it's a nice little neutral starting location. And we're going to ride the Silt Strider to Aldrun and then we're going to take the Silt Strider from Aldrun to Margan once I get up the stairwell. So first the Aldrun. And then we're going to go to Margan from here. Now from Margan, we can get to Kogorun in one fell jump, which uh, for those of you who haven't watched many of my videos before, I love my jump spells in this game. So we're going to use far jump, which buffs my jump by 100 points for three seconds. And we're just going to take off towards Kogorun. Make sure we face the location of uh, Kogorun on the map and basically just jump in that direction. And we want to use acrobatics too before we hit the ground. Uh, or rather, use the same spell before we hit the ground, that way we don't die. And here's Kogarun, as you can see. Easy peasy. One jump to get there and basically all it took. It does take away the enjoyment of exploring in this beautiful game, but uh, I don't feel like wasting so much of your time in these videos. Right here is a, uh, a corpse of Feral Sal Salmine, and uh, he has a full set of Indoral armor as well as a uh, hair shirt of St. Aralor, so that's worth mentioning. So uh, once you get to Kogorun, you're going to want to go into the Halls of Fisto, which is where you see me at uh, right now, and then down to the Halls of Maki, which are right here. Once in the Halls of Maki, you're going to be looking for the, uh, the corpse that has these items on them. It is, I'm pretty sure, not there. I think it's this way could be missed actually you know what no it's to my south i know where it is should be in this hallway right here pretty sure this door oh, that door's locked so you'll need a lock level of 20 be able to open a lock level of 20 in order to get in and in each of these rooms there's corpses on the ground and each of them have some goodies but this is the one this is the room right here with the glass armor as you can see Glass shield, glass cuirass, and he's also got this fury weapon, which I highly recommend you don't use because there's a bug in the game that makes the, uh, bug in the original release of the game that makes the debuffs the cast on you permanent, which is, uh, not good, not good at all. And that's really all there is to it. As you can see, it's quite easy to get in here, quite easy to get to this corpse, and, uh, you can get these somewhat early on, um, during the game. You're actually tasked with coming to Kogarun at some point, uh, during the game, but you can get these at any point, um, any point you want, even at the at the start of the game. But that's all there is to it. If I forgot anything, please let me know in the comment section below. That way everybody knows what information I left out and everybody gets all the information they need. And if this video did help you out, be sure to leave me a like because that helps me out. Aside from that though, I will catch you guys around in future Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind videos. Peace.